I beg that we receive our chief guest. Ladies and gentlemen, we will stand up and receive our chief guest. Wait, 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 wait,
qualities in total and the number of over 6,000 uh, athletes already with us. And the officials are over 1,500. We have this championship first of its kind. We abolished uh, the weighing and we are using the lean, but again we put physical screening because some of our teachers are not authentic. They go on and put not bona fide players. But now we are trying to put some measures to cover that. Should we in the future get you on that line, we shall be able to remove your team and even deal with the one who has done that one as a couplet for the entire world to know what is there. But so far so good and things are going to put on plan. This championship is running from 25th August to 6th September and so far so good as the ministry we are humbled and very happy that of the 167 local governments, 144 local governments have turned up for this championship and this championship is basically for participation for all, talent identification and inclusive sports. So in that, when I talk of inclusive sports, you have another category of learners uh, of special needs. So those are uh, the runners with hearing, impairment, uh, hearing impairment, who have issues with the vision, uh, who have issues with the, 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 the limbs of the body. So they are also they have also been invited and they are participating actively in this uh, As far as handball is concerned, we are very prepared. We have come to defend our under 14 trophy, but at the same time, take take other good trophies in the hand. Uh, this is a, is a handballing district because in the past years, like in 2022, we took three trophies. Uh, last year, we took one trophy. We are going to defend it and again add another one. We are first record with as usual. The level of completion increases, obviously, because more dishes come on the board and they also want to take back trophies back home. And this year opened up the actual age minus the measurements. So expect serious competition in this year's tournament because of opening up the right ages of learners. And that and that also explains why Uganda was overall in the primary schools and also secondary schools because of the actual ages we are playing on right now.